Hey, it's Lexi, and you're watching an Over Teams tutorial, where we give you the tools, the knowledge, and the know-how to grow your business, stand out, and inspire the world together. Many of you have asked us how we create these tutorial videos, so we thought it was about time we showed you. Today, I'm going to be sharing three key things we use to create these tutorial videos. So get out your notepads and get ready to see how you can create your very own videos, no videographer or ad agency required. Number one, the right equipment. First things first, you need two basic but really important things. One, a camera, and two, a sound recorder. We use an Olympus camera on a tripod and a Zoom H5 sound recorder for sound. It's really that simple. Plus, if you don't have a camera available to you, you could just use a smartphone. But I highly recommend investing in a good sound recorder. Number two, a good setup. Lighting is everything. More importantly, bright natural light. We use an area in our office that brings in a lot of natural light, but you could also achieve this by hiring lights at your local camera store. When setting up your scene, make sure it's clean and tidy. Clutter is a no-no. Bring your setting to life with some plants, books, stationery, and a few accent colors that match your brand. Put your host in the center of the video so that they are the main focus. And make sure to use a carpet on the floor to reduce the echo. And if possible, hang a few sheets around the scene to block any sound bouncing off the floor and walls. Number three, over. So, where does over come in? Well, every little title that slides in, big title that covers the screen, and video screen recording on a nicely designed background is created in over. Let me show you. For a little title, start with a transparent project in canvas size 16 by nine. This is the standard landscape video screen size. Add a rectangle shape for your title background and then simply add your text over the block. Use your brand colors and brand font to keep things consistent. Then save this image as a PNG this is really important because this format makes sure that the background is transparent. If you can't see the PNG option, then you need to go to settings and turn on the save as menu. For titles that fill the screen, start a new project in canvas size 16 by 9. Then create your title. You can use simple text on a brand color background or add a few interesting accents like graphics. Then you can save this as a normal JPEG. To create a screen that looks like this, with video in the phone, start with an empty phone mockup. You can easily find this by searching in Google. Then build a frame around the phone by adding shapes and moving those shape layers behind the phone. You can dress up the frame as much or as little as you like by adding a few graphic elements. Then, when you're ready to bring your video in, tap video and upload your video from your phone. Remember that video can only be the background of a project for now, so you'll be adding your video behind the frame. And that's it! Three key things for creating your very own videos. And remember, you can find tips, ideas and inspiration in our Discover feed. And if you need any assistance or have any questions, you can always pop us an email at helloteams at overhq.com. See you next time.